Hi there! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we're going to build a React application by using Tailwind CSS and Framer Motion. So, as you could see, this is our web application that we will build throughout this video. This website has awesome UI UX design, which is going to be excellent project for your personal portfolio. Let's open this web page in different devices. There we go. Now we have opened in tablet, but still everything is nice. Then let's try to open this in smaller devices like mobile phones. It is still pretty awesome for clients to visit your website. So watch it until the end and build with me this website that has great scrolling animations and UI design. And don't forget to subscribe and like the video to support me. Let's begin coding. Well, first of all, we should install initial codes of this project from my Google Drive. The link is in the description of the video. I have already downloaded these codes and unzipped them. Now, I have opened it with Visual Studio codes, and let's explore what is here. Well, let's start by opening public folder. Inside of this, you could see the index.html, which has initial basic codes, so let's move on to the src folder. Well, inside of src folder, we have the assets, inside of which we have all the necessary materials, texts, videos, and pictures that we're going to use throughout this video. And then, let's move on to the components. There you could see the components of the project that I have already divided them. And then utils, where we have motion.js. There you could find the codes that belong to the scrolling animations of the frame motion. Finally, there are app.jsx and then index, CSS, and all other packages. Now, I'll speed it up the video to 6x and you can slow it down if you want. And good luck watching the video and building the project. And again, if you have any questions or problems, comment it down. Firstly, we are gonna start by installing node modules. Well, then let's change some codes in app.js. Great job! Let's move on to navbar component.
If you have any questions or problems, comment it down. Let's move on to Component Home.js. Well done, guys and girls. Next one is Features Component. Then, there is award component. Let's do this.
Then, there is Games Component, but we also need to create a Card Component to map it in Games Component. Next is about JS. Let's move on. Well done. Ninth is Experience JS.
Well done. Tenth is work with us, JS. Well, guys and girls, we almost complete. Only subscribe and footer components left.
There we go. As you could see, there, we already complete the project and you can enjoy from the project you have done. And again, follow me if you would like to get other projects.